Hey all, it's Dan back with another quick review, and this time I'm reviewing Avengers Arena, the complete collection. This collects single issues Avengers Arena's numbers 1 through 18, written by Dennis Hopeless and Christos Gage. Uh, illustrators are Kev Walker, Alessandro Vitti, Ricardo Berchielli, and Carl Moline. Never heard of any of these people, but I do have to say that this was great. This was one hell of a story. Um, to give you the gist of it, it's kind of like Battle Royale, but it's like teenage superheroes. Kind of like the Hunger Games, but for those of you who've never heard of Arcade, Arcade is this X-Man supervillain. Um, he's known for, like, kidnapping superheroes and kind of testing their limits by putting them in his murder world. So basically, he takes all these team members, like these superhero teenagers, um, they're from different, they're from different team superhero groups, like, they're not all Avengers, so, like, I don't know why it was called Avengers Arena, because some of them were from Captain Britain's school, um, some of them are the Runaways, and then there's some that are from Avengers teams. So yeah, I mean, I guess the majority of them were Avengers, but I found this to be highly enjoyable. Um, if you're into those kind of like all-out like battle royale type of things, I think you're really going to enjoy this. I know I did. I like seeing like other, like, heroes and villains and stuff like that just kind of duking it out and just trying to see who's going to be the last man standing. And there's some interesting characters in here. While I will say, and I'm not going to spoil it because I'm not going to say who gets off and who survives, but I kind of feel like they introduced some really minor superheroes to knock off because some of them I'd never heard of. And then there's some convenient ones that are alternate world versions of current day superheroes. So yeah, um, I did find this to be very entertaining. Like I said, if you're for all out brawls and superheroes, definitely go ahead and check this out. I had a long time ago had read um, a storyline that followed up after this. So like, I had an inkling of what had happened in this book from that one, but this is my first opportunity having had read this. I'm trying to remember when this came out, because I know this is an older book, although I think this one is a newer printed edition, like finally collecting them all. I'll try to find out when this was originally... Oh, it's from 2018. But yeah, I really would highly recommend this, like I said. I thought it was super fun. It was a super fun read. It was kind of cool because Arcade is one of my um, more favorite villains that are out there because I am a huge X-Men fan, so like that was one of the things where I really liked seeing his kind of comeback. And he's it's, it's a nice little story, too, because it explains why he decides to come back, too, and... I gave this a 4 out of 5 star rating on Goodreads. I really think you guys should go check this out. I will have a link for those of you in the U.S. to pick this up from Amazon. Also, there's the free worldwide shipping link from Book Depository where you can pick up this or anything else. Um, I always try to tell you guys, you know, I'm just a single person doing this channel all by myself. There's so many other comic book channels out there that are like, they're like groups of people or they're companies posing as a single person filming videos that are getting, like, they're, they're being supported by, you know, other sources, like, they're getting free books and stuff, and I'm not, so, like, you would help me out if you guys could buy some stuff from my links. Um, if you came here looking for comic book graphic novel reviews, go ahead and hit that subscriber button. While you're there, hit that notification bell so you're well aware of when I upload again. That's all I got for you guys. Thank you for watching. Until next time, later.